Asking questions is a vital part of the scientific process. But it's not enough to simply ask any question. Science is about asking good questions. Questions that can be answered through direct observation or with scientific tools. Questions that examine the relationships between phenomena. For instance, let's examine the question, what's the meaning of life? Well, this is certainly a thought-provoking question. It's not one that's easily answered. Its answer would likely be based on your individual values or beliefs, so the answer would vary greatly depending on the person doing the answering. So while this might be a good question for a philosophy or religion class, it's not the best question to be answered through science. What about the question, what's the best brand of sunscreen? This is a better scientific question. However, it's still a bit vague and leaves room for personal interpretation. Best could mean cheapest, highest SPF value, best smelling, or most likely to stay on while swimming. Consider the question, which sunscreens have the highest SPF? This question is better, as it can easily be answered through direct observation. You just look at the available sunscreens in the store and compare their SPF values. But this question is a basic data collecting question. While it's useful in building knowledge, it doesn't require any explanation or experimentation, so the question can still be improved upon. How about this? Do sunscreens with higher SPFs block more UV light than sunscreens with lower SPFs? This is an example of a good scientific question. It isn't based on values or opinions. It examines the relationship between SPF and the amount of blocked UV light. It can be investigated through a controlled experiment and the results can be quantifiably measured and interpreted.